What's up, my name is Technobe here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll show you how to fix the GPU device was lost error, saying the game cannot continue for Sniper Elite 5. Usually this is caused by you trying to run Sniper Elite 5, a DirectX 12 game, on a DirectX 11 supporting graphics card. In other words, it's not up to date enough. There is a simple workaround for this, though you may not experience the best things while you're playing the game. The absolute simplest solution is to get to the game launcher. For me, I own it on Steam, so I'll simply start it up, get to the in-game launcher, and click the settings wheel next to the play button. Then simply locate rendering API and select Vulkan instead of DirectX 12. Click OK, and when we launch up the game, we should be getting to the main menu where we can actually begin to play. You may notice some FPS drops and inconsistencies compared to DirectX 12, but if you can't even get into the game, it's an infinite improvement. Of course, you can also skip the driver warning down here if you're running older or modified drivers that aren't supported by the game. At this point, your game is probably more than likely fixed, but if it's not, then it's probably because you're on a gaming laptop or something similar. Simply click Start, type in GPU and open graphics settings. Now, of course, on Windows 11, this list takes forever to load, but when it eventually does, you'll have a dropdown with two options, desktop app and Microsoft Store app. If you have it on the Xbox Game Pass, select Store app and then click Browse right below it. Select it from the list and it'll appear on this list down here. Otherwise, if you have it on Steam, like me, select a desktop app and choose Browse. We'll then navigate across to where the game is installed. If you don't know where it's installed, open up Steam, right click Sniper Elite 5, hover over Manage and click Browse Local Files. Now, inside of this folder browser, we can click at the very top, right click and choose Copy. Then, inside of the file browser for our settings window, we'll click at the top, paste it in, and hit enter to navigate directly into the right folder. Then, we'll open the bin folder and look for Sniper 5 DX12 and Sniper 5 Vulcan. First of all, we'll select and add DX12. Then, we'll scroll up, click browse once more, and this time we'll add Vulcan. After adding both of these to the list, click on one of them, choose options, then choose high performance and save. Then we'll click to the other one, Options, High Performance, and Save. If you added it from the Xbox Game Pass, you'll only need to select one of these, Options, High Performance, Save. Now, at this point, you should be able to play the game. Assuming you're still having issues in that first launcher that I showed you for the first solution, make sure that you select to run the game in windowed mode. That should fix whatever else is stopping you from getting in game, and at that point, you should be able to enjoy it. Anyways, thank you all for watching. My name is Techno, but here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.